Hey everyone, take a look at this Stone Blue Metallic 2022 Ford Edge. This one is in the ST line, basically giving you a package that's got a lot of nice features, looks really sporty and doesn't break the bank. Let's check it out together. So under the hood of this is the two liter turbocharged engine made into an eight speed automatic transmission. Really great on fuel. Uh, the vehicle does have some nice features like these beautiful HID headlights up front, which are fully automatic, including set it and forget it auto high beams um, so it'll just turn off the high beams whenever you get close to a vehicle um, it does have a forward collision system with uh, pedestrian detection so if somebody cuts you off last minute you can't put the brake on it'll stop the vehicle that saves you lives and saves you some money on insurance with the ST line the bumpers are definitely a little more sporty the grill is more sporty and you see these beautiful black aluminum alloy wheels on the side that definitely have a nice look you see the ST line badging here the color matched mirrors uh, the mirrors are a power mirror, heated, and have a blind spot system in them, so that lights up when someone's in your blind spot. To get in or out of this vehicle, you can just put the code in here and uh, unlock or lock the vehicle. You can also just put your hands inside the door handle to sense the heat from your hands. Uh, you can lock it by just pressing this button, or you can use the key fob, which has unlock, lock, remote start, power tailgate, and alarm, or you can download the Ford Pass app and do that anywhere in the world from your phone for free. Um, tinted windows off the back look great. I love this stone blue paint the metallic flake is excellent open this up and you get your first look at this gorgeous st line interior you have the red stitching accents on here which look great um, you do have this nice seating so this is like a microfiber finish and then synthetic leather on the sides um, it's called active x material look up top this does have the upgraded uh, fully panoramic sunroof with power shade letting in lots of natural light uh, also has the all-weather matting upgraded in the back you have vents for your rear passengers you also have a fully inverted power supply and usb-c and usb power supply which is really nice um, as we come back to the rear of the vehicle um, so you'll see this one does have the upgraded trailer tow hitch uh, which is great. It's also got rear backup sensors and a rear backup camera. That camera does have a little washer nozzle to spray itself off, which is pretty cool. And it does have a power lift gate. So if we press this button twice, that's going to open up. And you see a lot of cargo room in here. Very generous with that. Nice little pockets to put things as well. Uh, and then we can put our seats down and we can actually just use this button right here and we can put both of our seats down, which is really awesome. And that gives you all the usage of all that cargo space. Let's go up front and check out some of those features open up the driver's door and you'll see some of the controls we have our power locks our power mirrors and power windows those set it and forget it automatic headlights your fog lights as well as traction control in the rear power hatch on the signal light switch you do have a button here that's to turn on or off the lane detection system which is pretty cool it does say st line as soon as you get in and then you have this super comfortable 10-way power adjustable heated seat and the ford seats are so comfortable in these which is awesome Let's jump inside. Okay, so we get inside this. It is a push button start. Let's go ahead and hit the ignition there. Um, you do have some nice displays in here. We've got uh, readouts on both sides. Um, this side gives you all of your fuel and you've got um, you know, digital speedometer and uh, that side tells you stereo information. Uh, on your steering wheel itself, we have controls here for the left side. We do have our cruise control here and this has been upgraded with the adaptive cruise control so it'll slow down automatically with the vehicle in front of you. Also has the lane centering technology so it'll actually steer the steering wheel um, uh, for you using the lane markers on the road, go around corners and everything. On this side, you've got, again, controls for the other side display, and then controls for our stereo, our phone, and our voice hands-free. Uh, this beautiful leather wrap steering wheel, definitely very sporty, and it's got the nice red stitching there. Up top, you've got a nice pocket to put things, and then the huge screen. Uh, this screen was all new for 2021. Um, in this screen, you can see there's a hard base navigation that has been upgraded on this one. Uh, and then you've got controls for your climate control and your heated seats down here. Now, they've added some new features to 2022, and that is some games. Um, so you'll see here we've got uh, lanes, sketch, tiles, and we can go into a few different games that you can actually play on this screen, um, which is pretty awesome. Uh, lanes is my favorite one as basically you are driving a car uh, on your screen in your car. So yeah, that's neat. Um, come down below, we've got volume controls for our stereo. Uh, then we've got a nice pocket to put things, USB and USB-C PowerPoint. We have our rotary style shifter um, with sport mode. So when you put it in sport mode, there's actually paddle shifts 
right behind here that you can use to shift up and down your gears, electronic park brake, some really nice um, sporty features for just the trim on the vehicle and then engine auto off to turn the engine off when you're not using the power. We've got a nice big console here with an upper and a lower section underneath. Come up top, it's an electrochromatic auto dimming mirror. We have some map lights, and then this does have that upgraded sunroof. Um, we have controls for our power shade and our sunroof controls. And speaking of shades, you do have a sunglasses holder right there. Then you do have um, garage door openers here as well, which is really nice. So um, overall, the ST line, beautiful, great value for the dollar. And this one has a nice package on it. Thanks a lot for watching this video, guys. Do me a huge favor and click subscribe to this channel. Go ahead and hit the bell icon and you will be notified every time I make a new video. Uh, have a great day.